welcome this is the mystical magical reading for Halloween for the water sign <laughs> I want to say thank you for being here you water sign please like and share these videos this reading is for the water sign energies this is for the Pisces Cancer and Scorpion this reading is a magical mystical reading because um, a lot of people are not aware that as of the 31st of October until the 31st of March is when the magic begins. Okay, so no wonder Christmas is um, done at the end of the year. And with a lot of study, the American holidays, they fall in specific days that have specific meaning. And it's like you have to um, study spirituality and the unseen world to understand why there is certain holidays that fall in certain days okay so okay halloween is the time the mystical time and uh, from the 31st of october is where when the veil begins to thin okay and what that says is that it's the time that you can connect with the unseen world and you can ask your spirit guides for help personal help and help with financial and uh, that sort of a thing now ladies and gentlemen please use the energy only to ask for healing this year healing and abundancy because if you use the energy for something different it's going to turn around on you okay i'm warning you guys so um this year especially because um, what is happening is that the universal energy because of the transition of the planetary systems and all of that that is happening there is a lot that is going on time is going to be going faster and faster and faster um, Jupiter is coming in alignment with the heart um, Saturn and it's just a whole lot so especially for you water people especially for the Pisces that is governed by Neptune scorpions are governed by uranus and the cancers that is governed by the moon this is one of the most beautiful time to manifest what it is so um for you guys especially the scorpion your birthday is just beginning and especially for the people who um are born on the 31st of october oh my god it's like you have the most mystical you're the most mystical person so and all the people who have met that is born on the 31st of um 31st of october happy birthday you know who you are i'm sure you guys are happy birthday now this is a good time to manifest what you want so materialistic whatever you want to it from now the 31st of october until 31st of march beautiful 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 especially the Pisces who were born February going into March oh my god so Pisces scorpions are having a mysterious time you can manifest anything you want that is positive healing um, new mobiles new um, uh, new business the new clients anything to make your world and only things um, to help you okay only things to help you so be aware of what you manifest okay very good alignment so please share these videos share 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 these videos um, especially for you Pisces and scorpions the people who are just having birthdays 31st this week um, 31st of October oh my god it's just so wonderful okay so what you have here and this is just so beautiful um for you water sign remember you have the seven of veils the seven of cups in the reverse so you're coming in um not dreaming anymore coming in and want to manifest new things in your life this is going to be good this is wonderful remember that this reading is timeless so whenever you receive the read this reading is the time that you should have it it is just timeless so, so as i'm i see here seven it's going to affect um, um, seven that is a scorpions okay 
then we have strength the scorpions you have to find strength you need to manifest more scorpions and release okay release then we have the energy of temperance some of you are dealing with issues and situation where you need to balance this out okay so you ladies are going to be good you men need to balance out things so whatever is happening the ladies are okay but the men needs to balance out things then i'm seeing the ten of bells the lies and deception are going to be coming out some of you how you can do is to um, manifest that the truth comes out so you manifest whatever is happening the truth comes out if you know someone is lying and hiding behind the truth manifest that the truth comes out about this person so I'm seeing that you scorpions are going to be having the power to manifest yourself out of negative situation and manifest the truth out of the people. This is beautiful. The ten of tombs. Money is going to be coming in for you guys. Money is going to be coming in. Manifest money because it's going to be coming in. So you guys, as I said, and I felt it and I saw it number 10 is new beginnings new beginnings to everything new start and um, whatever is happening the omega you will be knowing what is happening before it even happens okay so this is good then we have this energy of the four of bells the four of bells keep on coming up remember this reading is uh, um for the people who are in the fifth dimension you will see these things coming up for the people who are in um the the fourth dimensions 21 days after the people who are in the third dimension three times 21 days afterwards it will happen okay four of candles the four of candles this is beautiful so some of you are going to be finding out the truth about a house some of you are going to find out the truth about a situation at home some of you are going to be finding out the truth about a work situation a corporation an institute some of you are going to be finding out the lies and deception about a company or organization you are going to be finding out the lies and the deception about this organization it is all coming out but there is going to be a lot of parties party like you never party before oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god <laughs> Hey, you guys are the first ones to get new love coming in. So this is wonderful. This is positive. What is this? If you're a woman trying to get pregnant and you can't get pregnant, manifest this. So just ask the universal angels to heal whatever is making this unbalanced that you can't manifest this child because a baby you guys can manifest baby you guys can manifest new love babies and new love you can manifest what i'm also seeing for you water sign people is that people who wanted to, to get married and uh, are moving together new love is coming up a new place new situation uh the six of veils the six of veils is the six of cups I'm seeing some issues with family and, and situations, okay? So it could be friends, some issues is coming up with friends or past life, family and situations. So um, this is definitely coming up. So I'm seeing that some of you have to find balance dealing with issues. Um, and it could be um, balance dealing with emotional issues. I'm seeing you're trying to balance out your emotional self, okay? then we have the five of bells the five of bells is the five of swords where i'm seeing some of you having some issues some of you could be getting married having a party and there is some issues where it's about this uh, getting married and having a party issues about a house i'm seeing coming up for some of you um uh, but it could be also issue at work because it's issues about a party if there is enough money and that sort of a thing creative candle is here um the energy of the candle um the creative candle is here and i'm seeing your creativity is a little bit down so you guys got to be aware of this so um some of you could be creating a new love new baby i'm seeing this is not happening just wait off just ask the universe and wait off the creative candles this is someone between the age of 18 and 45 
okay it can be male or for female i'm seeing you trying to create or um um call in a new love but it's not coming in because it's not the right thing and this is what i said to a lot of people before you start using this mystical reading to start manifesting you gotta know what to manifest i'm seeing an organization is in the reverse some of you are having issues um, this could be custody battles, issues with divorce and that sort of a thing that you're dealing with. An organization is really in the reverse, okay? So an organization with a family issue, um, there is conflicts, there is, um, it could be um, an uh, hospital, that sort of a thing that you're dealing with. Okay, so you men are the first persons who actually comes up in your reading. So, um um this is issues with the men 45 years and older whatever is to inspire you guys are worried there is a lot of worries um you men 45 years and older are having a lot of worries if you have because lies the lies came out and uh, um whatever that was transformed because uh, um you men if you have a company or so the lies came out now the three of tombs is here i'm seeing some of you are trying to manifest love and a child hen it's not happening right now it will happen after the 31st of uh, um march okay so whenever you pick up this reading whatever you're manifesting if it doesn't happen it's not going to happen the same time okay it happens like 21 days after or after the 31st of march but I'm seeing that people are going to be coming in and helping you. And the last energy is the energy of the moon. A lot of you cancers are going to be affected by this unseen period. Um, and cancers who have issues with organization, I see your secrets are coming out, cancers. So you cancers that have issues with organization, I see your secrets are coming out whatever is a transpiring the eight of veils is here and i'm seeing some of you men that has thought of walking away from something i think you're 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 gonna wait it out okay so the, you know whoever because the men comes up and they're saying that some of you men i thought about walking away from something and i see that you're reconsidering so whether it's the end of uh, November, the end of December, the end of whatever. I'm seeing that some of you between the ages of 18 and 45 is going to be reconsidering something. Whatever. If you were thinking about ending a relationship, I think you're reconsidering something. If you were thinking about moving forward, um, leaving a company, I'm seeing you're reconsidering something. And if you were thinking about manifesting a relationship or a new love, I'm seeing you reconsidering this and said, you know something? I better stay with who with with who I'm here. It's as if your financial stable and you're going to stay put wherever you are or in whatever situation. I'm seeing you not manifesting. I'm seeing that you manifest money and money is here. So your financial stable. So whatever it is, you're thinking, okay, I'm staying put. And it's affecting the men in the spirit. It's definitely affecting the men. Now, what I'm seeing is that some of you are, are so happy that the lies and deceitfulness has comes out. Some of you are really happy that the lies and the deception has really come out. Okay. 10 is your number. 10 is your number. Very positive. Um, the moon is here. And this is what I'm, I'm really liking is that the moon is here. 10. 10 and 4, 10 and 4, and 10 and 4 is 14, energy of 14 is here. So you're going to be using numbers to manifest, uh, manifest here things in your life. And what I'm seeing coming up where you have a cross, okay? And in the cross and at the top is that you have a strong foundation, okay? Especially especially people that has been very positive working towards positive vibration and good things in your life i'm seeing some of you are going to be getting married some of you are going to be meeting a new love you're going to be moving in 
I'm seeing um, issues about family is going to be coming out. I'm seeing some of you find inner strength. You have now financial stability. You have love. I'm seeing the ladies, the younger people who wants to have kids. You're really working on this because there's a lot of worries. Um, some of you um, are going to be hearing from a hospital or whatever the institute is. Um, you know how um that you know whatever is transpiring with your um to um your ovaries your eggs um yeah what i'm also seeing is men 45 years and older i'm seeing you dealing with a capricorn um and this capricorn um this is really psychic person so it could be that you're going in a relationship with this person, whoever this person is, this person is really psychic. This person is a powerhouse. Um, this person is vibrating on a high vibrational level. So don't even try to manifest this person in your life if you're not ready for someone like this, because it will backfire. Okay. And um, this means that if you're trying to manifest this person using um, magic or um, love magic or whatever, um, this person is going to feel it and know it and they're going to block you. So if you really want to be in a relationship with a Capricorn, it's a very psychic person, you got to do it in the right way, like communicate with a person. But if you try to use magic, um, love magic to um, attract this person, this person is going to repel. A lot of people do love magic in this time. I wouldn't advise it. Um to keep someone i wouldn't advise it because it's not going to work out okay because what is happening and what is transpiring is that what people could do in past time it's coming up that you can't do it in this time okay i'm seeing a lot of you are really connecting with the capricorns whatever is going on capricorns and the tauruses i'm seeing you um connecting with these people okay so some of you are dealing with a Sagittarius or a fire sign person. And what is transpiring is that you found out their lies and deception. So some of you, it's not really a Sagittarius, it's just a fire sign person. You found out their lies and deception. It could be that you're in a relationship with this person, but whatever is happening is that you want to know the truth, so you manifest the truth of a, out of a situation. And you found out um something now there was some deceptive move what a gemini has done and it's all going to be coming out be careful because i don't know why it's coming up for you water sign people but i'm seeing love magic um so be be careful now what i'm seeing here is that you can cancers could be dealing with some issue with a virgo whatever you're dealing whatever issue you're dealing with a virgo i'm seeing you're like your energy is like really out okay and it has to do with financial situation because christmas is coming up you guys want to have money it could be that you might be speaking about divorcing or handing a relationship or you could be getting married and you're trying to figure out are we going to have enough money okay uh you scorpions have an issue with a house, whatever this issue is with this house. Um, you scorpions have a house or a business, and I'm seeing a lot of worries. Um, and it's as if the family do not want to support you in this. And it's it's happening to the older scorpions. Whatever is transpiring with a situation with a house or a business, I'm seeing that the family is not really supporting you in this, okay. Young scorpions, I'm seeing that you're kind of um, in this manifestation period. You're getting out of a devilish situation that has played with the organization against you. You're finally being released. You have a strong foundation. So you young scorpions. Mm. What I so love, go check out the rest of um, Crosswatch, the rest of the reading to see for your son's, uh, your moon sign. And the, the signs that comes up in your birth chart and for your partners to see what comes up. But for you guys, manifesting um, a house or business or work is, is good. Manifesting love is good. 
manifesting a baby is good uh, manifesting financial stability is good but I'm seeing the creators are going to be having some 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 situations the creators are going to have now I'm seeing um new love coming in there is worries um some of you are worried about a, a um um um, working together a situation on the uh, working together in organizations some worries is coming in some worries is coming in I'm seeing issues uh, for you scorpions um, but you are going to be coming out very strong and you scorpion are going to be uh, manifesting new love and new homes um, this is coming up I'm seeing for you older people, you're having issues with um, corporation institutes, your organization does a lot of work for you. People between the age of 18 and 45, there is a lot of worries. You guys are, especially you men, are extremely worried. Men that have business, um, 45 years and older, you're extremely worried. There is a lot of worries that is coming up for you men. I am seeing that whatever is going on, um, you guys are like going to manifest peace because it's as if the veil is thin and you're going to be speaking with your angels and guides and trust me, water sign, I'm warning you, if you uh, manifest evil or something negative for someone else or destroying someone else, you're going to be destroyed. So if you manifested something deceptive or something horrible happened to someone else it's going to be flipping the coin and happen to you okay um if you if you ask that someone be yield and that financial abundance come in for the person then you are also going to be receiving it so let's say you're going to be manifesting new love for your parents let's say your parents have divorced and you're manifesting new love for your parents okay it's going to be happening say you have been trying to get pregnant for so long and you have been manifesting yes it's going to happen let's say you have been manifesting a house and to buy a house with someone and live with this person yes it's going to be happening okay but once you manifest something that is negative it's not going to be happening okay So you got to be careful of what you manifest. But um, I'm seeing the older men really worried. So what else is coming up? What else is coming up for the water sign for this mystical Halloween reading? Your numbers is going to be 10 and 4, which is good. 10 and 4 is really magical numbers, okay? Because this also has to do with healing. So you guys can ask for healing. Because um, 14 is the energy of healing. So, wow. Hmm. Someone was here. Someone was here. I just turned around and I, I turned back. Okay, so I guess you got your message. So let's see what's happening. Mm -mm -mm. Some of you are dealing with a woman that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius some of you found out that this woman has lie and deceive you whoever this woman is this woman is coming up as an Sagittarius so the truth is coming out about a Sagittarius or a Leo 45 years and older can be a Sagittarius can be a Leo but your emotional pissed off because you found out the truth about this person because it's like you 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 manifest the truth you ask for the truth of this person and it came out mm. so you got to be aware of because if you want to find out something and you ask for it, it's going to be happening okay so whoever this woman is and however she affects your financial situation you're going to find out the truth now we're seeing the energy of money that some of you could be receiving some money okay and it has to do with that this woman has done something deceptive 
and some money is going to be coming in for you whatever she has done um so yeah an organization is going to make sure that this lady pays you some money so however and whatever she has done an organization is going to come in and make sure that this lady pays you some money okay this is so so weird so um um yeah um this organization have to pay you some money so whatever is transpiring and whoever this woman was this woman is coming up as an Aries Leo or Sagittarius whoever this woman was and whatever that was transpiring um and that's the reason why the ten of pentacles is here because a lot of money okay so all right ten of cups is here so definitely some of you are going to be happy um, lies and deception comes out about an, a lady 45 years and older that's an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. I'm seeing happiness is being returned in the family. I'm seeing some of you are um, a balance. So financial stability is going to be coming back in the family. A balance. Some good news is coming up. Good news. Um, uh, a new love could be coming in. Some of you could be finding out that you're pregnant. Um, Good news is coming in, especially for the um, the young people. Um, I am seeing here that uh, some of you have to make some decision on organization. I'm seeing some of you have to make some decision. So I'm seeing an issue with the organization. It could be a family situation, whatever is happening. You have to make a decision with the organization. Then I'm seeing the three of ones and whatever is happening, um, in this mystical reading, go back and check out the rest. I'm seeing that some of you want a new start with someone. A lot of you are going back and asking for a new start. So you could be returning to an ex-love and asking for a new start. Okay. So I'm seeing this coming up. Money is not going to be a problem. And this is, you know, just about everyone. It's as if the energy of money is coming up in this in this uh, magical time because it's from the 8th, the 31st of October until the 31st of March and I'm seeing money is going to be in that season yes it is the season of Christmas but yet still I'm seeing the effort of manifesting money because you people have the nine of Pentacles and the ten of Pentacles and the nine of Pentacles and this is letting you know that it's not only a little bit of money that is going to be happening, but a lot of money is going to be coming in. Okay. Six of pentacles is like a little bit, you know, four of pentacles. I'm seeing an investigation that is happening in the organization against, uh, um, you scorpion, your company could be under investigation. You scorpion, your company could be on the investigation so this is coming up for you young scorpion your company could be on the investigation then i am seeing an end is coming in for some of you men 45 years and older i'm seeing the end with the issue with a capricorn if some of you were dealing with a capricorn or some of you were manifesting in your life creative endeavor and that sort of a thing I'm seeing some of you have decided to end something with a group organization or a network and I'm seeing you're not going to do that um, but it, it, it could be that you want to leave a church and go to another church or you want to leave a sports school and go to another sports school something like that but I'm seeing that you thought about it it could be relocation that you wanted to relocate and you thought about it and you decided no i'm not going to do that so that could be um coming up some of you are really dealing with an aquarius gemini or libra whoever this person is his secrets is coming out whoever this person is his secrets is coming out whatever is happening and transpiring i'm seeing this person's secrets coming out okay so the energy of the moon is here whatever the secret is and the secret is coming out okay so whatever that has been happening has been transpired i'm seeing the secret coming out uh, again 
a lot of you are dealing with unbalanced things that is going to be balancing out because they're going to be finding out some secrets about an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra. This woman is 45 years and older, okay? Um, there is a lot of investigation that is going on around you guys, especially you can cement are really under investigation. Whatever has transpired and seen cancer men under investigation, whatever that was happening, whatever that was transpired, I'm seeing you cancer men under investigation. So whatever the issue is and the situation is, I'm seeing you cancer men really really on the investigation um whatever that is happening um if you have a company a corporation i'm seeing you can cement on the investigation so um it's just um it's wonderful go check out and share 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 these reading go check out and see what is happening for the rest of the people and the rest of the sign um whatever it, the issue is and the situation that is playing out Go check it out and see what is coming up. I love you guys. Enjoy this mystical reading. It doesn't really matter when you receive this reading because the readings are timeless. If you're vibrating in a fifth dimension, you are going to realize that whatever you manifest is just going to be coming out. For a manifestation reading or finding out what is happening under the veil, you can always use the website and order um, behind the veil reading. I love you guys. Namaste.